Hi, Lieutenant. John? How are you feeling? Well enough to gather up my things. Uh, can I help you? That's all right. I'd rather do it myself. He's here. Hey, Sergeant. Are you all right, Bob? I'm fine, Basil. Just take care of it. I'd like to see my client alone. You gonna allow him to give us a statement? She got to be kidding. In that case, you can meet him in court. Hey, you're not gonna give them five minutes? Not now. You want, you can get it on record with the desk officer you were here. We'll start the fives. Put him in handcuffs in front of his wife? We had no choice. No? How about picking up the phone and calling me? What about letting me bring him in? What do I do when he jumps on the plane? He keeps out at Teterboro and skips down to Costa Rica. You could have had me as a friend. Instead, you have me as an enemy. And for what? A dead pross. Whatever it is you're going to do to me, Chief, right now I got work to do. How are you feeling, Lieutenant? Not bad. How are you feeling? In the office. When I was in here earlier today, what did I tell you I wanted done? There were some loose ends in the investigation that had to be run down. Answer the question. What did I tell you to do? Close the case. Did you do it? We were getting information I thought was worth pursuing. Did you call me and let me know that? No, sir. Did you call the borough? No, sir. Did you call anybody in the off chance I may find out what's going on? Things are jumping off pretty fast. I hadn't gotten to it yet. Oh, you hadn't gotten to it yet? Let me know is the first thing you get to. With all due respect, sir, I told you I thought that there were questions about the legitimacy of the confession. And did you make your case to me about what those questions were? I tried. You tried. That's right. And since I didn't appear to be getting anywhere, I decided to continue the investigation on my own initiative. I'm sorry, but I think my first obligation was to work the case according According to the evidence that we were coming up with. Now, your first obligation is to make sure I don't find out what happens in my command on the 6 o'clock news. You get that, Sergeant? Yes, sir. Now, I put you in this job. Already, I regret it. You embarrass me again, you're going to regret it. Comstaff files are on the shelf. Why don't we up for review? A week from tomorrow. <sighs> Thinking about taking a foot post in the Midtown Tunnel? It's a shaky perch you're on, Sergeant. You have to answer to the people above you, look after the people below you, and you have to be able to live with yourself. What are my chances? As far as the last two go, I'd say they're decent. Good luck with the first one. Thanks. It's all yours. Okay. We're sorry if we lost anything up. Don't worry about it. Everything came up fine. Not exactly thanks to us. You're gonna make good detectives, guys. Give yourselves time. Thanks. We're real glad to be working for you, Sarge. Good night, Sergeant. Good night, John. Hey, feel like celebrating? Not tonight. 
Yeah, we figured. Sometime we should celebrate, though. Sure. We're proud of you. about you running the squad, Andy. Well, today you put them all to rest. How's it feel? Takes some getting used to. Not from where I'm standing. Good work today. Good night. Boss. <laughs>